train is here, Hell Monkey. As if you mortals can be saved with one little squeeze. Kill me, and I shall be replaced by another, and another, and another still. You cannot point that pet gun of yours at all demonkind. <laughs> and wherever you are not looking is where the greatest threat shall be. One at a time, we shall seize the treasures of your life as spoils and leave only emptiness and despair. My last gifts to you. <laughs> Just don't forget to wrap them, Puta Claus. By the way, Hotspur, how is your dear sweet Paula? Is she hanging in there? <laughs> Fuck you! Yeah. <laughs> 
nicely. Can't you see the little peach is coming on to me? Come on to this, pendejo! Oh, demon hunter! Your bullets have no bite, no penetration. <laughs> you need more rust! Diablo says this. That was just the appetizer, Hotspur. A taste of what's in store. So you know my name. And you don't know mine. Please, call me Lemming. Oh, you're not going to get a bounty over one little blonde bombshell. Tell you what, you can have the girl back, good as new. If you atone for your sins against me for slaying my legion of demons, admit that you challenged a greater power and lost. Admit that your endowment will never measure up to my own. I will admit you're a fucking asshole. How's that for Lemming? <laughs> oh, so be it. A place for Paula has now been set at my table, mortal. You cannot have her back now. But come to my castle in the underworld, and you could still join in our revels. Such a tempting offer. I do love a party. Maybe we could play Pong. One, two shots! <laughs> I would say, you slay me, Hotspur, but you don't, you can't. Now say goodbye to Paula. She has a lot of dying to do, and coming back to life, and dying some more. I like to keep my mistresses guessing. Yes, help her! Because in the meantime, I'll be helping myself. stretched out before us doesn't mean we have to... Is there a problem, Johnson? Well, I'm just saying, demons are buttholes. You really wouldn't like it there. <laughs> Says the former demon. What's wrong? Lost your spine. Uh, okay, okay, look. If you want to go to the underworld, good on you. But you don't know that place. Look, 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 look what they did to me. A few little transgressions, and now I'm doomed to an eternity of heavy metal jokes and, and posing for pirate flags. It's only worse for mortals. Then all the more reason to go. They have Paula. So the way I see it, you are either with me, or you don't. No! <sighs> Get on. All right. Vamanos! The underworld lies just beyond the sound barrier. How do you know? It's like super classified demon information. <laughs> Not according to the internet.
This is your old barrio, right, Johnson? Then you can be my tour guide. Me? But I quit the whole demon thing ages ago and written my memory's absolute rubbish. Oh, I'm sure it will come back to you in no time. Relax, amigo. This is going to be an adventure. Our very own road movie. And the best part is, you never know what's waiting around the bend. Won't be on this side of the door. All right, let's start this road movie with some road kill. That's right, G. Don't let all that peace and quiet push you around. Huh. When demons hear the name Garcia fucking Hotspur, they run the other way. Johnson, what the hell is that thing? Holy cow! I don't believe it! Willie! That's one-eyed William! Friend of yours? Are you kidding? William is my aunt's first husband's adopted son from the Ukraine. Then you are practically brothers. The underworld be a shadowy place. Anyway, not a problem. Take a look over there. You see that lamp? Hanging on the wall? I can light that up for you. A light shot, of course. Give it a try, G. There. Did I brighten your day? What can I say, Johnson? You are the right tool for every job. So when do I get to light up some demons? I'm sure you'll have your chance. They hate my light shot. Leaves a nasty rash. Save up those white gems, G. These demons are not very talkative. What have they got to talk about? Once your soul rolls into town, that's it. You're damned. And Fleming doesn't let anybody off the hook. He sounds like a real dick, Tater. <laughs> Johnson, why is there a goat head hanging on the wall? Oh, well, everybody knows that goats are a source of light. 
Right. Of course. Poor Tyke. Most new arrivals in the underworld are condemned to guard doors like this for the first hundred years. Uh, we all have to start somewhere. Garcia? Huh? Paula? Come back! Paula! Easy, G. This place is full of deceptions and dirty tricks. Is that a floating... Strawberry! Oh, gimme, give gimme, give gimme! Give oh, these things are like demon catnip. When I was little... Johnson, do I take this strawberry? Yes! Jeez, excuse me for having a little fruit fantasy. Don't you dare give my strawberry to that sprog on the door! No! Gee, you berry squanderer! <laughs> ah, drinks! At least there's one good thing about the underworld. What, liver damage? That's the beauty of it. In the underworld, you don't die from drinks. They unkill people. Paula? Paula? Ah, que es esta mierda? I was afraid of this. What? Why is it suddenly getting dark? This isn't ordinary darkness. If you stay in it too long, it'll suck the life out of you. Quick, use the light shot on the goat head. You can't stay in the darkness like this. It eats away the flesh of mortals. How did you know shooting a goat would banish the darkness? How did you not know? Some demon hunter, I say. <sighs> Just warn me if I have to fuck a horse to unlock a door, huh? Paula? Is that you? I can't see for shit. Ahem. If only there was some way to shed light on the situation. Don't mock me, bitch. Just use the light shot on that lamp. Sorry. Themselves. It's what's for dinner. Madre, not again! And this time there's no goat to save us. Quick, the door! Run through the door! Ah, oh, much better. No darkness and, dare I say it, no demons. Good. 
What the fuck? Why won't this demon die? Don't waste ammo. The darkness is protecting. Nice one, G. How do you know to use the light shot on that demon? Are you sure you need a tour guide? with her when she picked out that lingerie. You? In a Chictoria's secret? <coughs> oh, are you fucking kidding me? Keep running! There's no way to disperse darkness this thick! More darkness dead ahead. At least we're standing on the bright side of things this time. If you can call this bright, I hear bleating. Better check your goat, da. What the fuck is that? Hmm. Let's go with big and hopefully dead demon, shall we? Strawberry! Underworld has a pub? That's right, and vending machines too. If you're damned, you're going to need convenient access to drinks pretty much 24-7.
red gem. What does this do? Shh, shh, shh. Keep it down. That's a performance enhancer. Very shady. Very, very illegal. So, Johnson, do you eat eyeballs too? Perish the thought. It just so happens I'm a fruitarian, thank you. These human hearts let you withstand the darkness longer. I'm not even going to ask how that makes sense. So, uh, does Willie always take a big smoky dump in public? Yeah, you should see him piss. At least we can keep track of where we've been this way. Demons can't stand light. Gotta put it all somewhere, you know? Barrels. I can see they gave the problem a lot of thought. Cubes are blocking the door. Hey, look up there. There's a switch glowing the same color. Hold on. What? Where else have we seen that color? You reckon taking a walk on the wild side might bring this whole situation into perspective? Let's have a look at the switch from inside the darkness. Fucking hate puzzles. Hell, wait for me! Hijo de puta! Cute trick. Oh. 
Go again. What's that fucker's fucking hand doing here? Um, it's his world. Nothing's out of Fleming's reach. He's literally got a finger in every pie. We're surrounded, Chief. Wait, we can use these barrels. They're filled with pressurized lights. They'll explode. trying to bring down the house. Get alert, G. That corpse is reacting to the darkness. Light this place up before it spawns more demons. Dulcet tones. How lovely. Yes, kind of. <gasps> oh, fudge! What am I talking about? This is what caused those tremors. It's a melody of death. 
Oh my god! Oh my god, 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 god. Why should I be afraid of a few puny earthquake? What the hell? Noticed, huh? No! Stronger demons require a constant supply of human blood, which they store in special repositories on their bodies. They're a source of great power, but also an exploitable weakness. Talk about wearing your heart on your sleeve. 